This weekend, we will be celebrating our confirmation class. Since January, we have been meeting together and growing in our understanding of faith, theology, the Bible, and United Methodist history. This has been a great opportunity for me to get to know a bunch of our youth and also for them to explore more about what the church is and what it means. We spent time diving into the Trinity, to some United Methodist history and John Wesley's past. We also learned lots of different pieces of the Old and the New Testament. This was a great chance for them to ask some important questions and develop their own theological language. I am terribly sad that we aren't going to be meeting together on Sunday to offer the ritual of confirmation, which is one of the few rituals in the United Methodist Church that includes a laying on of hands. The only other time we do this is when someone is ordained. And so we're going to hold off on that ritual, but we want to lift up each of these confirmands and their hard work over the past few months so that we can honor what they have done. We're going to be lifting them up during our prayer time, and I would encourage you to think through the ways that you have been a part of our church. Do you remember when you were baptized? Are there pictures of it or stories that you can tell, go back and tell? Do you remember when you were confirmed? Who your mentors were? Who taught your confirmation class? Did you receive a Bible? Are there different pieces of framework for when you became a member of Arvada United Methodist Church? and how meaningful that was for you. Do you remember the pastors who have been involved in your faith journey? Is now a time in your life when you could reach out to them and give them a call or write them a letter of support or just to share a memory of your time as we share together in the joy of this confirmation season? I'm so excited about the opportunity to have all of these youth become members of our church where their voices and their thoughts and their ability to lead us forward will all be a part of our future together. I hope that you can join us in our virtual worship service on Sunday so that you too can lift up each of these confirmands in your prayers and your thoughts throughout the coming weeks and months. I hope you guys have an excellent Friday.